And here we are, the most intense part of a movie, the climax, the finale of Upper Michigan today. Tia, we're here in the, uh, well, upper story of the Peter White Public Library. And where which way are we going to go? To begin. Because there are two different ways you can go. So you can see folks are packing into both sides. And I'm starting to whisper because these films start at 10 o'clock. So I know we have about five minutes left. So, but we have filmmaker Aaron Peterson with us. So thank you for taking a moment out of your very busy day no to problem. talk to us about your films. How long have you been uh, participating in the Fresh Coast Film Festival and showing your films? I started the Fresh Coast. Oh, you start? I'm so sorry. <laughs> 2016. So you've been showing the, the whole, whole time. The whole darn time. The whole time. Yeah. I didn't know if you were like playing movies every time or just Some starting years it. I have my own. This year I have two. Um, but yeah, I'm the programming director for the festival, so I watch all the films, I program all the films, and and then I just kind of sit back and watch everybody enjoy so it. Just like the eyes and the ears of the whole everything. We we all work together. We are the glue that holds it mm -hmm. together. Yep. And uh, what, are, what are you going to be showing from, uh, from the mind of Aaron Peterson? I have two short films. One I, was done in conjunction with the Sioux Tribe mm -hmm. in Sault Ste. Marie. The other one is a weird, wacky biking film with a gentleman from uh, Calumet, Michigan. Oh, great place. I have a deep connection to the Cunard Peninsula up there. You know, Aaron, I'm just going to say this. You know, I have a great uh, amount of respect for filmmakers because, again, you're dealing with, like, several different art forms, the visual, the story, and, of course, music, you know, if that's included in there as well. So the one question I'm not going to ask you is, well, what's the favorite film you've ever, ever produced? What's your favorite child? Well, some can answer it. Most won't, okay? But you've seen a lot of films here. So let me just ask you this. What do you think are the prime ingredients that make a great short or just a great film in general right well f for me personally uh it, it's humor uh you know this is a documentary film festival so we get into a lot of serious sometimes heavy topics but the ability to lighten it up with humor i think is, is a key ingredient for doc work absolutely and what do you absolutely. think sets this festival apart from the rest what Though I, all of them in the whole world. What I hear over and over is our audience. Yeah. Uh, the filmmakers come from all over the country, and they are always impressed with our audience, which really makes me proud that this, this community welcomes them, asks sincere questions, cares about them, and that's... I think you know that's that's as good as it gets for yeah. a, for a filmmaker. Yeah. And as a as a filmmaker, what kind of discussions do you want to have with the people in attendance? What kind of, do you hope that they ask questions at the end of the yeah. screening? You know, a lot of it it's it's that human element. They want to know more about the person behind the film. Where are you from? How did you come to this project? How you know? What did you study to get here? Did you study anything to get here? So uh, all of these filmmakers come from a very different backgrounds. So everyone has a unique story. You know, the thing about being a filmmaker is it is a potent mix of skill, chance, and um, you know a little bit of risk. So you know what advice? Because again, there's so many people out there who want to have a crack at this style of art and expression. What is your advice to people out there who want to get started? In this? Yeah, I mean, do it. Just, mm. just start doing it. Do it. Make mistakes and and do it over and over and over and show it to people. And I mean, you you can't do it if you're not doing it. Mm. So get out and do it. Use your phone if, if that's all you have, you know. But uh, stories are everywhere. Stories are everywhere. And and I feel like the utilization of resources and the importance of resources. That's kind of. I mean, that's not like what the Fresh Coast Film Festival is about, but it's what us here in the UP are about so you don't have to be so perfect it's not on the the glossiness of the end product it's about the process it's about the stories it's about what's being learned through it all and then the sharing of that absolutely I mean that's the beauty of doc work you never know where the story's gonna go it's not scripted so you start following a story you think might go one one way and it goes another and you, you follow it and do the best you can yeah it's a journey for everyone those who who's directing it, who's all involved, those who are watching it, you know? It's, again, experiencing art in a variety of ways, and that's what's most profound about it. There's not one way to make a film, not one way to watch a film. And the best part is, you have your screening, and yet you can, there's so many people in the future who are watching the same film, and that's what's profound about it. We have just one minute left, so one minute left till this film vlog starts. What are, what are your hopes for this weekend, and if... And, and what do you want to say to the people that are still maybe thinking about coming down? Yeah, I mean, I guess my hope for the filmmakers is for them to find community and grow mm -hmm. community. Um, my hope for the audience is to learn something and hopefully go away uh, in inspired.
Right. Well, I wanted to thank you for your time. I'll let you get into one of those rooms. That's all we have here on Upper Michigan today, though. So it's going to be a really lovely weekend. I just wanted to remind you that you can get your tickets at the headquarters. That's located at the Marquette Commons. You can find the full schedule of events at freshcoastfilm.com. Thanks a lot, Robert, for joining us. Well, See you guys you on Monday. Me. Support local artists. Experience something new. Enjoy the show.